Uh, I'm here to talk about some uh, new uh, approach and treatment for uh, macular degeneration. And as most of you know, a lot of people uh, do have macular degeneration that we treat in the office. And uh, a common question is asked, uh, what are the treatment available, am I going blind, and so forth. Uh, nowadays, there's actually uh, a few different treatment options available. It's an exciting time for treating macular degeneration that uh, we have uh, three different drugs that we use. And uh, these are uh, medication that we administered into the eye with a uh, fine needle. Uh, obviously, we numb the eye so we, uh, the patient does not feel it. Uh, we also have a, a specialized uh, a cold laser treatment as well that we combine it with uh, medication. And that, uh, in general, uh, we tailor each treatment to an uh, individual patient because everybody responds differently. Uh, for example, patient A may be respond different to patient B, so we don't really approach it like everybody's the same. We individualize our therapy uh, depending on how you respond, uh, and we also uh, adjust our uh, treatment interval. Uh, so all these are tailored to how you respond and, and how people do. And we also advise people on uh, vitamin supplement and lifestyle adjustment because there are newer studies uh, indicate that uh, nutritional intake is a, a vital role, uh, play a vital role in people with development of macular degeneration. And so all these we provide a service. Uh, in addition for people who are uh, more advanced and more far along, uh, we even uh, provide uh, special uh, surgery care for people who have uh, what's thought is uh, untreatable uh, macular degeneration. Now, now we, uh, there are actually some surgeries we offer. Uh, in addition for people who just for more for uh, rehabilitation, uh, we also have what we call uh, low vision uh, evaluation that we provide. Uh, one of our optometrists here that provides advice on what kind of magnifier to use, uh, what kind of uh, strength for uh, glasses, and things like that to help patients to get adjusted back uh, to live independently. Uh, and to be able to uh, read and enjoy what they do.